morning you guys. It is early in the morning today. I'm wearing the same t-shirt yesterday because I had a sleep and I forgot to like change. I'm gonna go in the shower very soon so I thought well I'm not gonna get changed like a new fresh t-shirt because obviously this is yesterday's t-shirt and if I get changed with a new t-shirt for showering then I look dirty and I have to put on the same t-shirt again whilst I'm clean so I'll have a dirty t-shirt but a clean body so I thought I may as well have both. I may as well have a clean t-shirt and a clean body so yeah, that's why I'm like wearing the same t-shirt yesterday but anyway I'm gonna make some breakfast now because it's early in the morning and I'm going to work very soon for well, like in like five hours time um so a bit long time yet but but you know what I'm gonna make myself some pot coffee today because I got some like, coffee you know like coffee grounds which been like a coffee maker it's like the, like pot coffee things well I'm gonna make some pot coffee and I'm also gonna make some bacon and toast so um quite a good breakfast so I'm gonna... Okay, breakfast was done. I've just had a shower as well, so that's why my hair is very wet. Well, I've got a shave as well. I haven't, I haven't shaved in quite a while. I feel like my shave, well, not have shaved, my hair is always growing my chin like very quickly, but I had a shave, so that's pretty good. But yeah, I feel like freshly brewed coffee is like better than the actual coffee though, because I had a like, freshly brewed like pot coffee this morning. I bought a lot of like coffee things to make pot coffee with, but I never actually used them until like today. But I have to say, freshly brewed coffee is the best coffee. Okay, I'm doing something which I hate doing. I'm phoning a dentist to make a dentist appointment. And I don't know, I feel like I'm one of those people who cannot phone for appointments. Like, I hate being on the phone anyway. Like I'd rather just text and rather be on the phone, but I'm having to phone a dentist because there's no sort of system where there's like nothing to like book with. So you have to like phone to book it. So I'm gonna phone a dentist right now, which I'm very terrified of. I don't know why I'm so terrified, but I'm just like really terrified to book appointments and stuff. So I'm going to um, book my dentist right now. I'll do it on camera actually. Here it is. Oh, it's not even just like, it's not even like answered, so. I've kind of got lucky this time, but I'm gonna have to like, keep writing them today because I need to make a dentist appointment so bad because uh, I've not had been to dentist in like a year. I mean, I was meant to go like, earlier this month, but then the original dentist cancelled because apparently the dentist we normally go with um, left, so. And they had to cancel my appointments, now I've had to make a new appointment, so. I put it off for quite a while, but then they phoned me saying I'm, I'm due an appointment, so. And I'm having to like phone up and like make up an appointment, so. Yeah, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get ready now to go to work. And I might go for a walk afterwards as well. Um, I might bring a coat with me though because it's about to rain. I think it looks quite dark outside. So I think it's gonna rain, I don't know. Alrighty, my working day is done. And now I'm in the park right now. I wanna go for a walk, so it's pretty good. But um, yeah, so it was like kind of like tiring because I woke, I woke like three hours this morning. I'm four, only like four hours of sleep. I'm about to get really back to sleep, so I'm quite tired, but um, I was determined to come out and have a bit of a walk, so. I mean, it's all worth it though for these nice views. to find this cute cafe which has like a cookie dough ice cream thing in a waffle cone so I don't know if you like ice cream like I love ice cream but like never eat it until I go to like a farm or like a park or something I'm like addicted to ice cream and I always say oh I'll buy ice cream with like the freezer at home and then I'll get around to it so this is my first ice cream in like a week and yeah this cafe is quite cute actually I have to say very small but cute how much look at this cookie dough ice cream with a beautiful view of the lake.
Hey, I am back from that walk now. It's pretty good. Um, except for the fact now I've got a few stains on my pink top. But anyway, I'm kind of a bit tired, so I might go for a nap um, for like an hour. And then when I come back up, I've got a crochet thing, which I got from Home Bargains before, which one of the kind of do. So it's autumnal and it's a pumpkin crochet thing. And I saw it and I thought, hmm, I'll do it. I'll, I'll try and do it because I can't really crochet on needle for toffee. Um, I'm going to have a try of it. It's, it might be good. Um... Anyway, I'm very tired. I'm gonna eat some snacks and have a nap. So I'll see you guys whenever I see you. Hi, okay, it's much later now. I've just had the nap and it's a lot much longer than I expected. I went expecting to nap for like two hours, but that's only like three hours. But anyway, I'm back now and I've got this like pumpkin crochet knit thing. So I went to a bag, it's fun. I found this and it was like a make your own, well, crochet your own pumpkins kittens. And I'm not really good at like knitting or sewing. I tried to knit and sew before but I just could not hack it for some reason. Like I, I was never just able to knit. I tried knitting like several times and actually was never sort of was successful. And it's also raining really heavily outside as well as you can hear from the roof but oh ha ha ha. So you have this like pumpkin thing here so got stuffing here, neatly threads and stuff here. Um got more threads and filling. Oh it's because you made like two pumpkins so it's two lots of Threads. You got these things here which I'm not sure about. And um, they got an instruction manual as well, so um already it looks um really complicated. Like you've got to take instruction manual and it's um still it looks really complicated. Like how am I supposed to know all this? Okay, so this got instruction manual so complicated, like how am I supposed to know all this? It's saying like round one to SC in each STD and like all that kind of stuff and um, I don't know like how you supposed to like, do all this like what the actual kind of hell how am I supposed to do all this I cannot knit for toffee I've tried knitting before and it's like, really bad so I never gonna be able to do this actually um, I'm gonna have a try of it but I don't think I'll be able to do it because I mean this is like the most complicated looking thing ever <laughs> Oh, I can't do it. It's like so complicated. So I'm trying to look on YouTube for like simple like crochet things because I've never actually crocheted before and this instruction manual does not help. It's saying like put a loop through a back finger and you do this and you put a loop through that. I don't know what loops are okay. I don't know how to do anything with crocheting so I'm going to research how to crochet. Well, I'm on like a website called Sarah, um, what's it called? I don't know. And it's saying how to crochet for beginners. A complete, guys. Crochet is a fun and relaxing hobby. Well, I don't think it's a fun and relaxing hobby. I think it's a very stressful hobby, actually, for me. In this step-by-step -step guide, we will discuss how to crochet. Oh my god, exciting. How to hold a crochet hook. So, I presume this is a crochet hook, this metal thing. It shows all these like, pictures as well, so I'm gonna try and like, do this thing. I'm, I'm determined to do this crocheting. Even if I don't know how to do it, I'm determined to have a try of it. God's sake, I can't even do it. Like, I'm trying to like, look at like the step-by-step -step instruction, but I just cannot do it. Oh my god, I'm like really frustrated. Because I wanted to make these like pumpkins, but now I can't because I cannot crochet. I'm trying to do like, a slip knot thing, but it's like so complicated. Like it's telling you all these things like, oh do this, do that, and you'll be like as if you know how to crochet. Like I do not know how to crochet at all. So it's like really frustrating. I'm gonna like try I'm gonna have to like ask someone who knows how to crochet, like to come here and like actually try and teach me because I look like look at this online thing and it's not doing. So that's a bit frustrating. I wanna make these like pumpkins so bad, but now I can't, so um, this was a waste of four pounds. Um, I had to pay four pounds for something which I cannot do. Very frustrating. Screw it. Oh my god. It's like literally the biggest fun ever. Like, uh, I literally, like, I wish I could have a camera, but you can't have sort of heard them, but I'm putting like crochet stuff away. I'm still being hacked off by that crochet thing, but. Oh my god, something scary really happened just then. There was a thunderstorm. It's happened again. Oh my god, it's like so scary. I was like, it's like loud, it's scary as well. Like, again, like, it happened like a huge flash just then on the Velux window. 
And it like literally was like the scariest thing ever. Like it flashes and it's like big sort of like like it's like big rumble. Oh my god, it's much later now and I've been editing like a music video for someone so that's what I've been kind of doing there more like but the thunderstorm still really strong like I remember like five minutes ago it was still thunderstorming so yeah very scary. Um and I still hacked off about that um crocheting thing like I don't know why I can't crochet. Like everyone else seems to think it's relaxing and Everyone's always like, oh, crocheting is like so relaxing. You should try crocheting. But I cannot do crocheting, so how can it be relaxing when I can't even do the thing? Anyway, I'm going to go to bed now. I'm very ready for my bed. I had a nap before, but uh, it was like three hours, so I'm definitely ready for my bed. So I'm going to go to bed now. And tomorrow I'm heading off to somewhere, so that's also pretty good, so... Um, yeah, I need to be off early as well, so it's about 2am, and I need to be by 6, so, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to go to bed now, and I'll see you guys whenever I see you. Bye! <laughs>